Hey guys, yours truly, Kevin Grace. I am here at the airport in Cincinnati, and of course, through my travel, sometimes you see a lot of unique and different things. Sometimes, even at the airport that you never knew about. So, I want to show you this car behind me. It's called the Crosby Super Station Wagon. So, before the Mini Cooper, there was a small car here. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This is kind of cool looking, huh? Check it out. Let me tell you the history about this thing with this plaque over here says uh, this was made in 1951 and uh, this was the brainchild of Cincinnati businessman and inventor Powell Crosley Jr. Each 1951 Crosley Super Station Wagon weighs in at a feather light 1400 pounds featuring a four-cylinder engine that could propel the car at speeds up to 60 miles an hour and boost an impressive fuel economy of 30 to 50 miles per gallon. Crosley was truly ahead of his time. This car is one of 7,000 cars produced by Crosley Motors in 1951. At the peak of production, over 26,000 units in uh, 1948. Sales dropped off, significantly forcing Powell Crosley Jr. to cease production in July 1952. This particular station wagon is unique and that it was owned by Powell Crosley Jr. and used at his Pinecroft estate in Cincinnati. The car was donated to the Cincinnati Museum in 2000 by Crosley's great-grandson, Coleman. And this car got uh, restored to running order. So I don't know what this little door on the side is there and you can see how small the little tires are it looks like it's convertible that the the top maybe comes off <laughs> a little soft drop top let's see this thing on here so this is interesting let's go around this other side here I can't get back in the back of it but you can kind of see inside there a little stick shift there have no idea how much this thing costs and uh, if anybody else has had it I'm gonna see if there's maybe uh, a video that can go with this so we can know a little bit more about it and you can see even the hubcaps have got the Crosley name on it and this is little this little gas tank here but again like I said you never know what you see throughout your travels and just wanted to let you know about something new. Meantime, over 80 years ago, the world was introduced to Crosley's, the automobiles manufactured by the Crosley Corporation from 1939 to 1955. 20 to 30 of those little slivers of history make up the West Coast Crosley Car Club, and they hit the road today, making a pit stop in downtown Bakersfield. One man in particular has several Crosley's in his collection, with one that took him a little over a year to build. I own a total of five Crosleys that run and four out back. So I, I'm into Crosleys and just like them. They're different. Crosley, based in Cincinnati, made sedans, trucks, sports cars, and even a precursor to the SUV. For an in-depth look at some of these unique cars, watch 17's Robert Price's report tomorrow after NBC Sunday Night Football right here on TV 17.